All right, how's it going? I just got back from the grocery store and I figured this would be a pretty good opportunity to explain how many or how much groceries I can fit on my bicycle currently, if anybody's curious how many groceries you can get. So, as we're looking here, I have a 2017 Giant Content 3. It's a road bike, 25 millimeter tires, all that good stuff. I have a rack on here. It's a, I think it's like a, uh, what is it, I Benza? It's, you got a rear rack. They have two of these Bushwhacker uh, pannier, grocery pannier bags. If you're curious about any of this stuff, I'll put links in the description below about it. There's all that. Then, of course, a book bag as well. So, we'll, uh, I'll set this up and then I'll, I'll start unpacking this and then we'll kind of get an idea of how much you can actually fit with two like pannier bags and a uh, book bag as well. All right, so I'm gonna start unpacking this and we'll see how much it is. I spent about 80 bucks, but the beer was like 17 of it, so I can carry beer, so that's a good thing. So we got the Samuel Adams Oktoberfest. We got some bananas. I got some bananas here, and also two of these Goya Golden Maria sandwich things. They're like uh, the Milano cookies, but cheaper, and they taste pretty good. And uh, Goya. Then in the other bag here, we have four frozen pizzas. Uh, I really like these Freschetta four cheese pizzas. I used to do DiGiorno because DiGiorno is like five bucks. One time they're out, I got this, and this is like, this is the same price as DiGiorno, but it's, um, the taste is amazing. Amazing! Like I said, we got four of those. Then in my book bag here, which I think we can see, we got my saddle bag that I keep all my tools and stuff in case you get like a flat and whatnot. We have two, two liters of Coca-Cola, which is like, I like on the weekends, pizza and Coke's a good thing for me. Uh, also we have, we got some canned food here. We got uh, like four things, uh, petite diced tomatoes. We got some more Goya. We got some of those black beans, those frijoles negros. We got that. We got four of those. Let me get the other two. Like I said, we got four of those. And then we got four of the. Uh, I I was getting the corn with uh, roasted peppers, but they've been out for a couple of months. I don't know if it's because of the. Uh, the uh, the virus that's supposedly going around the pandemic. So we got, I'm trying the uh, whole kernel fire roasted corn blend. We'll try that. Like that. I also have four. Oh, we have four two pound bags of extra long grain white rice. So eight pounds of that in total. Let me get that out here. Then lastly we have five let me get it out here. Five eight packs of like the Kroger flour tortilla burrito styles, which is good. So, in total, here, like I said, this is this is all carried on my bike the two bags and my book bag. So we got the beer, the bananas, the Coke, like 12 can, 12. 12 cans, the two things, the four pizzas, eight pounds of rice, and then that. 
Uh, I just figured if somebody's like curious about you know getting into cycling more, like oh, well, I got to get groceries. Well, you can carry a pretty substantial amount with just a few things. I mean, I could, back in the day, I used to just use like uh, the book bag. Obviously, you can't just do at that point, depending on what you buy. You can't just do one grocery trip a week if that's what you're used to. You usually have to do two or three. But it just depends on what your schedule is. And like the grocery store is a couple of miles from me, so it's not too long. Yes, if you really wanted to, you could probably get one of those trailers that you hook on the, uh, like on the back side. They have trailers that you'd like hook into the back wheel axle and stuff, and you can carry more that way. But for me, I live on a second floor apartment, so I don't want to have that and like try to take it down, and that'd be a lot of hassle, so I'd just do that. So, yeah, I think I'd just make this really quick, if anybody's been curious. Uh, if you like this, you can like, comment, and subscribe. I'm trying to get my subscribers up, but uh, yeah, like I said, it's about 80 bucks. It's about all that food, so you can get a substantial amount on a bike. All right, peace.